you might have heard this getting glorified of that life is endless learning you have to that's why you have to be humble life is vast you have to keep learning till your last breath you have to keep learning they and they glorify learning if you glorify learning like this uh, in a way you are getting stuck i don't mean you have to give up learning you can continue learning and you can do whatever you want but your notion that this is the ultimate this is the highest thing you can do this is the highest possibility has to go that's not the highest possibility you are not acknowledging that there is another thing you can do so these are all sattvic knots you see all good people do this all nice people <clears throat> make up these psychological knots for themselves by making up this kind of uh, conclusions as you know nowadays a few few years go by all this learning learning business whatever is happening will all be taken over by artificial intelligence it can do all the learning it can do much more learning than you can do much more quickly if you ask chat gpt you can ask or any other whatever ai tools you have if you ask this question to chat gpt do you understand what is a continuum the chat gpt will tell something about continuum continuum means mathematically it is this this blah blah i did once i chatted with chat gpt once. i asked do you understand what is a continuum it said yes conceptually this is what it is then i asked it back but your very basis artificial intelligence is based on bits it is based on discrete entities how do you how is it that you understand the continuum <clears throat> then it said yes it is true that i am based on bits but i can conceptually understand the continuum it cannot when its very existence is discrete how is it that it can understand the continuum it cannot the only way it can talk of a continuum is it is not discrete it is not discontinuous but the moment it says it is not discontinuous it is negating its own existence ai is not there the moment it says no bits so ai can do tremendous amount of learning 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 but it will not be able to understand this one word continuum that only you can so after ai takes over and ai does all the learning and all the work for you you have to focus at that one thing which only you can do because to you there is something more than the discontinuous reality <coughs> and even if you negate the discontinuous reality of what you are still something to you remains a continuous reality to you still remains from moment to moment <clears throat> there is no discontinuity there is no break in your sense of existence there is something that is flowing infinitely smoothly without any break and that is why you don't have <clears throat> a sense of break across time even if you remember yourself 20 years ago and now you still see that something is same you have been the same it's not the memory that has been the same it is not your personality that has been the same something has been flowing unbroken or even you don't have to go to years many years this now if you just sit right now and observe there is a continuity in your way of being so <clears throat> a continuous reality is also in your experience and you can acknowledge only you can acknowledge a continuum affirmatively not some simply by negating saying it is not discontinuous ai can only say continuum means not discontinuous but you can not only say it is not discontinuous but you can also affirmatively acknowledge experientially not huh? conceptually conceptually if you do you will remain artificial at the level of the mind there is nothing called continuous so if you talk of continuous 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 from the level of your mind if you say i understand continuum you are bluffing conceptually there is nothing called continuum it's necessarily discrete so if you don't acknowledge experientially acknowledge the continuous aspect of what you are you will look at ai as a competition because then you will see it can do whatever you can do 
you will start feeling inferior. You as the body, mind, whatever you can do, AI will be able to do much better in a few years. Even now it is doing already. So if you don't acknowledge anything more to you, AI will look like a threat. AI, AI will look like a competition. But if you acknowledge your continuous nature, <clears throat> and if you start falling into it, if you start getting absorbed into it, AI will become a boon. It will do everything else for you. You can just sit and think and enjoy. So if you don't acknowledge the continuous aspect of you, you will reverse yourself, remain artificial. You will yourself remain engrossed in the discontinuous reality. You will not become a life spark. 